Okay, now uh, let's try to fake. I want to fake lighting now because we said that lights are a little bit expensive for the computer to calculate, right? So there is a way we can fake lights uh, using nodes. So if we just enable nodes on our material there, enable nodes, now it gets all black, yeah, because we have to add a material. We saw this on the fracas tutorial. So we just add a new one or we select the same there. I just selected the same. We are trying to to save some uh, source resources here. So I will add a normal vector. I love this, no this this vector. So because it always it depends on the view, right? So you can see the white is always pointing towards the camera while the black um, outline so it's always there but if we click and drag on this little ball we can control this and have a, la a lighting coming always from the same side which is nice nice effect so what if we use this black and white thing as a mask for example to mix it with a color to mix this, for example, with the color from our material. Nice. Then you can add, for example, you can use another type of mixing there. Or you can even use it as a factor if you want. Or to have even more control, you can just use a color ramp. And that way you can control not only the intensity of this light but also the color of it if you want to color it like that fancy blue light that always come from the same side on most pictures or even on the video games like GTA I think they really overuse this in Grand Theft Auto 4 I think they use this uh, the effect but uh, too much I think so as you can see the light always come from the same side but we could also use it to fake some ambient light for example let's, uh, as you can see here on the game engine looks exactly the same just press P and it will run always from the same side it's nice so I was saying we could use this to fake for example some uh, another light for example ambient light like a bounce so let's say Carnarito is uh, on the outside for example on the park and it will have some ambient light of course so if it's on the park it will have the greenish color coming from the from the grass right the bounce of light so let's try to fake that so let's put it on some green there. Not that much, it's not like the incredible like Hulk Carnarito. So there. As you can see. Just playing with the colors and the kind of the kind of mix. We could fake some light. We could do the same for the sky, for example. If we just switch it to blue and move the light there to the top now let's put some bluish color there there now as you can see our character has one strong light from the back one bounce light from the grass another from the sky and still sen sensitive to light which is nice if it goes through uh, some lamp or something like a dynamic light it will always work that's nice. And the game engine also works the same way. So we can light without lights. It's nice. So nice. Let's move to the normal maps then.